So I'm going to be messing around again some with the uh, uh, nerve, muscle nerve control one. Um, it's really more of a muscle control. Um, but basically it's using these electrodes. So there's actually uh, worth starting with the electrodes because uh, some of the initial problems I had with this controller were basically because of the electrodes. Anytime you use electrodes for anything on the skin, the hardest part is pretty much getting a good, uh, like, you know, good conduction. So um, these are like have essentially a liquid on them, which is part of what makes them work good. But it also also makes them so they can dry out. So you basically want to seal them up as soon as you open them. So they don't dry out. And then you take your electrodes here and they just snap on your, on your conductors here. So, now we're going to stick these on our arm for now. The idea being you could really put them almost anywhere. The black one here is kind of a control in a way. So I know I'm going to use this muscle. So I'm putting it purposely out of the way. So it really won't react to that muscle. And that kind of gives us a baseline voltage. So this is where I'm going to start with them. That's how we go from there. Now you just put it here in the electrodes in um, the controller. Now I haven't really set it up or got it working yet correctly, but you can just kind of see it triggering stuff. It's really just triggering the lowest MIDI note right now because I don't have any of that set up yet. So I have it triggering these notes, and um, I kind of have it controlling pitch a little bit in the sense that how hard I do it can make the pitch go up. It's somewhat abstract. Let me give this a try. Okay, I have it hooked up so I'm triggering two notes at the same time and um, I think I have them separated by an active right now and then by using the envelopes um, I'm basically able to make one a short note and one a long note so what that lets me do is play a couple notes at the same time and kind of overlap them a little bit it's uh, still abstract but it gives me a little control and I'm just letting C's, E's and G's play and we're doing this on strings